Um, this is the Butter Hyperion 10 mm modular eyepiece. It's the 68 degree eyepiece field of view. Uh, it's quite similar to the Sky Watcher uh, SWA in a way, or Celestron Ultima X. That uh, is modular, so you cannot use it in the one and a quarter and two inch uh, barrels, eyepiece barrels. Uh, this is a 10 millimeter one. I have a 21 millimeter one, which I already uh, have a video about it. This one I had it and I never made a video, so I'm just going to make a video of this. Similar to this are the uh, Teleview uh, Dallas 72 degrees eyepieces, a 10 millimeter one I have. Later I will compare with them. And I have also a 70 degrees Pentax XW 10 millimeter. And uh, yeah. The thing is that with this one you can actually uh, move parts and m make a different magnification eyepieces. The focal length can be changed, it can be unscrewed and with a adapter you can actually increase the focal length of it, make it to uh, higher power and lower uh, focal length numbers, less than 10 millimeters. It's quite respectful weight. It's not very heavy, it's not very light. It has a big eye lens, which is really good in that sense that you can easily see the whole field of view if you get your eye close to this. Uh, I have here set up my Skull Watcher uh, ED-AT Apochromatic Pro Series Gold version. And I'm going to put this eyepiece here and uh, see what the result will be. So this is the writer Hyperion. And let's see how the image looks like in this eyepiece. That was the view through the Butter Hyperion 10 mm eyepiece. The object I was looking at is around uh, 30, 25 to 30 meters away. That pot with the petunia flowers in it and the little rabbit.